Hi, I'm so excited to give you another acting exercise that you can do at home for beginners or even if you aren't a beginner but you're feeling a little rusty like you want to read some scripts and have some fun and maybe socialize with some actors. This is a great way to do it and a really kind way to do it because you're going to be volunteering your time. My name is Belgica and I am an actress and I make lots and lots of acting related videos. So if you're interested in acting, consider subscribing and check out all of my playlists and videos on my channel. Today I'm going to tell you why being a reader for other people's self-tape auditions is beneficial for you and why it's a great exercise. If you are brand new to acting and you don't even know what a reader is, it's exactly what it sounds like. It's somebody that's reading the lines that the person auditioning isn't. So let's say I had an audition and my role was Jessica and there were two other people in that scene in my self-tape audition that I needed to do. Let's say Robert and Anna. Well, I would need a reader to read for those two lines. So while I'm, while I'm auditioning, they can be my eye line, they can be the person I'm talking to, they can be the person that is saying the other lines. That is a reader and you can do that online right now whenever I need a reader I usually ask my boyfriend or hop on zoom and do it through there I recently talked about an app called the actor trade and you can join the Facebook group and schedule different calls there for um, auditions through the app find people that might need readers and you can also join different acting uh, Facebook groups acting groups in general maybe somebody from an acting class that you took and be able to um, coordinate all of that and I do always hear from new actors about being extras in, in TV shows or movies in order to dip their toes into acting, which that is fine. You'll learn a lot about what it's like to be on set. You'll see, you know, other people acting. And if you are lucky and you're close enough to all of the action, you might see actors in action, be able to learn from them and see, you know, everything that they do if you really love that how they act maybe you can do research on what uh training they got where it got it from and also you can ask that question to the person that you are reading for i'm just going to use this app for for an example because it's such an easy way to join the group schedule calls and be able to help other actors and if you have an audition, uh, they can also be your reader. So it's a trading actor trade app. You trade time for each other. It's not paid. This would be a really great way for you to practice reading text, reading different scripts, and you can see how they do their self-tape auditions. So if ever you were being a reader for somebody and you really liked their backdrop or you really liked their lighting or something they were wearing, something like that, you can ask them, hey, where did you get your backdrop from? What kind of lighting are you using? You know, little questions like that. You shouldn't ask them, how do you do your self-tape auditions in general? Because of course it's going to be a super long answer because maybe they use a microphone, maybe they use a certain lens on their phone, an attachment or lights or back. It's, it's a really long answer. But if you have one question, you can ask them and, you know, just don't waste too much time because of course a lot of us when we get a self-tape audition request we only have two hours to two days to turn it in so it can be quite stressful and of course they're trying to concentrate on their audition it's a great way to socialize and make actor friends because let's say somebody really likes um the way you help with your read uh, reading for their audition you guys might become uh social media friends and be able to maybe one day see each other on set and become real life friends and other actors in your time zone specifically because i would highly suggest to connect with other people within your time zone so that you can help them out you know because some it's worldwide other people from different countries which is also a benefit for that app because if somebody ever has to film them an audition really really late or really early they're bound to find somebody in there let me know if you end up doing this and maybe i will see you on one of those apps one of these days thank you so much for watching at the end of every video i feature another channel this is today's feature if you would like to be featured on my next video make sure you're subscribed like this video and leave me a comment